The Force has awoken, and the last Jedi found. But none of this could have been possible without this guy, R2-D2. Wouldn't it be great to have your own Star Wars droid? Well, now you can, thanks to the new Star Wars Droid Inventors Kit from LittleBits. Featuring a simple circuit to build, a plastic body, and a dedicated app, this kit is available online for under $100. I'm Christian from MakeUseOf.com, but just how simple is it to construct your own 12-inch Astromech droid? Shipping in a handy box, complete with handle, the Star Wars Droid Inventors Kit is squarely aimed at children of 8 and above, so I invited my 12-year-old niece, Abby, to help out. In the box, she found six little bits, a control hub, a DC motor, a power switch, a proximity sensor, a servo, and a wire. Wheels and body components are also found, along with a collection of decorative stickers and a 9-volt battery. After a tricky start coming to terms with the little bits, Abby was soon well on her way to building her first droid, thanks to the guiding steps in the comprehensive mobile app, which doubles as a remote control. A word about the little bits, if you're unfamiliar with these components, they're essentially circuit components and wires mounted on magnetic interlocking plastic pieces. Wires run through the centre of the plastic while each piece has four legs to snap into a dedicated plastic breadboard. These components are expensive if bought individually, but other little bits kits, all aiming to simplify electronics for children, are available. Abby found building R2-D2 straightforward, but slow going. She started off by testing that the circuit works, then moved on to building the body. This version of R2-D2 is constructed from clear plastic, with the familiar three legs, domed head, and an access door on the chest. These components need to be fitted together. Firmness is required here, but excessive pressure can lead to breakages, so be careful. The Little Bits dedicated mobile app is a really great tool, guiding the build step by step. Each component is given equal prominence, and if it has a special feature, this is tested. For instance, once the motor and server are connected, you get the chance to manipulate them via the app over Bluetooth. The app also offers a collection of familiar R2-D2 sound effects. Finishing the build can be a bit tricky and may require some disassembly. Probably the most complicated part of the process is fitting the motor. But once this is done and the droid's body is fitted, you'll have your very own R2-D2. He may not be autonomous, but this droid looks great. In terms of suitability for children, there is no doubt that this kit is ideal. However, your offspring may not be totally adept at the finger gymnastics that are required. For instance, Abby found that if the power cable from the 9 volt battery to the power switch is not seated parallel to the little bit, it will force the magnet to decouple. There's a trick to getting the most out of a little bit's kit, and with practice most children should be able to get to grips with it. Just make sure you're around to help out if needed. Beyond the initial setup, there's plenty you can do to keep R2-D2 busy thanks to a bunch of missions for completion after the droid is built. You'll find these in the app, and they include the droid using a proximity sensor to avoid bumping into obstacles, attaching a pen to draw with, and even redesigning him with household items. Everyone wants a droid. This one might not hide your lightsaber or repair your ship's light speed drive, but the little bit Star Wars Droid Inventors Kit is affordable, fun, and delivers a satisfying educational toy to play with at the end. What's not to like? Head to makeuseof.com for the full review and to grab your chance to win your own R2-D2 with Little Bit Star Wars Droid Inventors Kit. And may the Force be with you.